Hey ladies and gentlemen, this is Jeff with I Download Blog. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to save dev files from Cydia. You know, you can do this using, you know, FTP, uh, using OpenSSH, you can use any other utility that you like to use, but the fact of the matter is you need to go to this directory right here. You need to navigate to the private directory, which is at your root directory, and then go to var, and then after you go to var, go to cache, which is right here, and then go to apt apt which is right here. And then after you open up apt, you should see archive. So this is the last directory that we need to go to. Here's where all your files will be archived. So just open up archives. And then when you download a file from Cydia, you'll notice that the dev file is stored temporarily here. So let's go to Cydia and then we can download a particular file. I'll choose action menu, which is one of my favorites. So just go ahead and tap install. That'll install action menu on my iPhone after I tap confirm, of course. And then it'll go through its normal spill right here, reloading data. Um, so it's installing action menu. Now don't restart Springboard. Do not restart Springboard just yet. Hop back over to your computer and then refresh the archives directory. Just right click on this utility and then select refresh. There it is, there's action menu 1.2.5, the dev file. So all you need to do is just drag this over to another place on your computer. So I've saved it to a folder called dev files and you can do this for all your installed files such as action menu sb settings etc etc so you can save off all your files for backup for later or whatever else you plan on doing with them and then after that all you need to do is just restart springboard and then you can go from there if you restart your phone i believe those files will be deleted from the archives folder so just keep that in mind let me know if this was able to help you out this is jeff with iDownloadBlog.